I guess Stanley saw it all as a package deal. You either cared or you didn't care. Not caring is associated with indifference and space. Caring is associated with difference and surface or the screen. The following example will show how space is associated with indifference or not caring and surface or the screen is associated with difference or caring. First, we see how space is associated with indifference or not caring. We see a shot which tracks back, emphasizing space. Here, we see Dr. Haywood Floyd having an indifferent attitude towards the new discovery which is the monolith. He browses through the pictures like he doesn't care about the monolith. Also, the way how Dr. Floyd talks about the monolith doesn't make the impression that he cares about it. Seems to have been deliberately buried. Deliberately buried. <laughs> he even laughs about the monolith, like he doesn't take it seriously, like he doesn't care. I don't suppose you have any idea what the damn thing is, huh? <laughs> Which the hell we did. Well, I must say, you guys will certainly come up with something. <laughs> After this, we see the spaceship approaching the surface, or approaching the screen. The scene on the surface doesn't have any shots which emphasize space. All shots now emphasize the surface, or the screen's surface, which is emphasized by the light flares. When Dr. Floyd finally touches the surface, or the screen, his attitude becomes different. He now is affected, he now does care about the monolith. Also, the whole atmosphere on the surface is so intense that it's impossible for Dr. Floyd not to care about the monolith. Just as the atmosphere in space is so dull that it's impossible for Dr. Floyd to care about the monolith. Also, when we combine these two shots, we see that Dr. Floyd also is touching his own helmet visor or his own screen, his own point of view. This indicates Dr. Floyd's realization that his own spatial, indifferent point of view, which didn't care, now has become a superficial, different point of view, which cares. So Dr. Floyd literally and figuratively is touched by the monolith. Thanks for watching.